Yeah. Like in some of the testimonies I was hearing, Uguti, there's the main house and then there's another house there's at the back food. house. No, <laughs> don't, don't do that. That's my plan. <laughs> 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 I, I went too hard. I went too hard. <laughs> <laughs> Pella Minang Intis! Intis are in the building. What's happening? It's another episode of the Shady Podcast. My name is Shady. That guy over there, his name is uh, Podcast. Podcast with the PH. What's happening, boss? I just realized I started the show with this lollipop and I it might be a bit gay. <laughs> Why are you gay? My brother, why are you gay? Yes. <laughs> 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 anyway. I hope you're not a lollipop in real life. Hey, <laughs> dog. <laughs> Pete! Hey, last week I, I, I said to our guest, uh, legend. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say that. Yeah, no. When you say legend, it's not the one. But he is legendary on stage, uh, award-winning uh, comedian, uh, corporate, corporate MC, MC. Yonkindo. Yonkindo yeah. Yeah. He's the best. <laughs> 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 I put you dollars in the building. Uh, yeah, man, it's going to be a whole lot of laughs. Um, very interesting character. I know him off camera and on camera. So, yeah, I don't know which version we'll get today, but. <laughs> the best, the, the best. best. And of course, uh, how are you, women in tech? I'm starting to feel left out, eh? No, oh, mm. come on. It ain't like that. No, you, we saved the best for last. Yeah, of course. Mm. Thank you. I'm good. How are so you? So, what does she do? Loot of fun. Nothing. Where's Dale? Uh uh. Oh, God. Balancing scales of fun. Otherwise, uh, yo, guys, online, man, I'm fragile, yo. You look fragile, my friend. <laughs> PH came in here on a trip. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> PH is 55 and he's having like 30 birthdays. Like, uh, PH is uh, a kick guide of birthdays. Yeah, like, man. <laughs> we can't even get booked at venues anymore. No, PH no, is PH having his birthday. Like, PH, I'm the top. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, you, 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 monopolizing the club yeah. game. I, had, I think I had three birthday parties this weekend. Plus... Delicious uh, fist. Plush. Uh, plush. Yeah, plush. Mm. Plush, yeah, that's plush. <laughs> uh, plush delicious. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm... How I'm, was the birthdays? Let's start there. Birthdays were lacquer. Mm. Uh, birthdays were lacquer. Crazy. Um, I'm fragile. This guy Why? Fragile. Can I yeah. ask a question? Mm. The fragility is because of the birthdays. When you're there, you're there, you're there, you're Everything. Everything, dog. <laughs> okay. Everything, dog. Yo, it's... And I mean, I was, I, I was what, I wasn't drinking for like seven months. Mm. So my body's just like, what's going on? Yeah, buddy? you're like, eating it hard, all been, in one month. You've been trying to feed me a Zempic that's not working. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now you're trying to kill me with, now you're trying to kill me with. With your Zempic, it's a pleasure. I tried to say, I'm going to give you a name. What's going on? The only thing that's going to solve this problem is HIV. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but no, the parties were rocking. And then, um, yeah, delicious. Mm. It's fucking cold, boss. Yes, it was cold. Bro, like when I woke up on Saturday, because I knew obviously there's the polar flow at yeah, delicious, yeah, you know? Stage, yeah. And I was like, you know, the, this weather also like came out of nowhere. Yeah, like a so thief in the night. Got up, I'm like, hey, son, ngati delicious in a street on fun every year. Every year, man. The SBC telling delicious. Oh, oh, stop, man. Fun. Oh, no, no, no. SBC, but I'm not. Oh, the linking I fell from Oakland Park. Yeah, no, I fell from my boy. Shout out, man. I said that, but I know the weather was cocked, dog. Lie to you, but um, people pulled up. Look, the thing is, it's an event that does most of its pre sale tickets, yeah, 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 in advance, you know, yeah, and it's a yeah. thing that people look forward to. Like, people sure. are not nobody just wakes up on the day and, like, oh, let's go past the list. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. People plan for this thing. A lot of Big people, time. it's like the highlight of the year for them. So, I didn't think people were not going to come. The problem is, about when the weather is like that, people end up coming fair to much later. because yeah, they're yes. like, ah, let's wait to see if the rain subsides. Yes. And then yes. you, you miss half the day because the program starts mm. early. Mm. You miss out on a lot of the acts. Sure. And know? I mean, the, the thing ends at what, nine o'clock? You see. So that Can't pull up at five. Yeah, that mentality of pulling up at five is not the one. But mm. 
How was your How was your stage? Stage ah anything that's got to do with the uh, polar. It's rocking, man. Yeah. Uh, shout out to everyone who came through. We love you. Um, yeah, it was, it was, it was. Yours was covered though. Yeah, ours was covered. Like mm, we, yeah. so we were um, inside inside the actual Kalami racetrack building. Sure. And uh, yeah, man, we had about 2,500 people inside there, mm. heaving tugs in. I'm sad you missed the because it killed it again. Yeah, tugs in. We had cubs of the small. No, quasi killed it. Uh, Heavy K. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, it was a fire lineup. It was a very fire lineup. Um, and it was indoors, which and it was helped. indoors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I also had fun. So I, you know, I don't like to DJ at my own parties, mm. but I, I closed the stage on um, on Saturday with uh, Mac Breezy. Ah. Smashed it. Uh, Smashed it. Yeah. I don't know. I sh even I, I I was like, I showed them one. Sure. Nah, it was in big. Nah, no, of course. Nah, it was a job. It was in big. It was in a spa. But yeah, man, yeah. Can, dope, can yeah. you answer on behalf of us going in your tweeting, you bought me? Sure. Like early on on the day, because again, the weather was a fuck up. We yeah. get it. I'm sure DSTV gets it as well. People were like, ah, what is this delicious fest? Winding a foggy marquee. They didn't even organize a marquee to cover. Come on. And I'm oh, like, bro, dog. this is like a field. It's a hundred meter field. No, Yo. more than. Huge. Yeah, no, you can't just wake up and, uh, you can't just wake up and get a, a marquee. Erect a marquee, erect yeah. Erect a marquee. Uh, you can erect Is a, there a marquee? That's <laughs> a <laughs> <laughs> you can, uh, you can obviously erect that, but uh, no, 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 bro. Like something of that magnitude, like the dome, a dome would be the only thing um, to cover to cover that thing. Mm. And that you need uh jock to approve. And those applications are Take done. forever. No, believe that, are done oh. months in advance. Yeah. You know, especially an event of that magnitude. You can't just wake up and say, must fuck it dent. Because yeah, it's it's safety, it's Structural engineering. Yeah, structural engineering. You need to sign mm. off. There's a whole lot of stuff. So I feel like, you know, off the yeah. point, but also on the point. Yeah, boy, we buy cars. So yeah. They fucked the game up yeah. by taking the dome. Big yeah. time. Yeah. Big, yeah. big time. Yeah. Big time. Yeah. Took away like a, a venue that could be seen as an alternative sure. in, in situations like sure. this. Sure. broken cars. Imagine. Hey, ah, they were wrong there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and in fact, ever, yeah, ever since, ever since, what's this thing? Uh, we buy cars, bought the dome. Like, I want to say the level, yeah, the level of... Um, the level of what's this thing? Concerts. Mm. I'd say it's dipped, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah. Because you, you, you're, you're dealt with, I mean, the only thing that can take that amount of people, or no, not even that amount, it's half, mm. is um, Sunbed Sun Arena. Bed. And they, you're limited in terms of what you can do there. Like, there's not Short. a lot. And even the structure of how it works as a promoter, I just realized it's actually those guys are fucked. You know, they don't get the bar, they don't give you the bar at um, Sunbed Arena. Like as in yeah. for from a revenue perspective. Yeah, from a revenue yeah. perspective. So as a promoter, wh where do you make money? So you make your tickets and, tickets and sponsorship. No bar. Yeah, but you have to obviously pay for the production. Yeah. Hey, there's a lot of yeah, so I was just like, starts yeah. cutting starts cutting into your margin. So it's like, mm. Mm. But also, I mean, the dome. Well, Tina Skulela corner in terms sure. of like Castle Light from the time that they started doing my extra cold music sure, concert. Sure. You know, you had Kanye at the dome. Sure. You had yeah. Drake was Drake, at the dome. Yeah. You had flipping Travis Scott. Yeah. And, yeah, it would Travis pack Scott out, crazy, and yeah. he sets up your corner as well. Is for like a delicious fest. Sure, you've Outside. got the center for the concert, but around the sides you could have all the food activities yes. that you sure. want. Yes, sure. Upu sure. sure. dance floor, go and buy chow, do your thing. Sure, and then when you come back to the center and the golden circle, gotcha. the concert is rocking. Yeah. You know, yeah. plus outside velunga activator corner. Hundred percent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but the trucks. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, let's get into it. Lolo's in the building. <laughs> nice day, <DJ. laughs> I put the yeah, lolos in the building. I'm a man, man. I put the lolos in the building. Hey, Paul and John, hey, who's that? <laughs> 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 you know? I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm a man. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Hey. Oh, it's fine. Oh, it's fine. What's your woman in tech, please? Save me. Like, save me. 
It feels like this episode is gonna be because I already know the one talking point. We might as well start with it. Oh, you wanna go straight into that? Just Lolo, where, you, where are you from? Who beka of it? A second, I'm from Malang. Ah, I'm from Malang. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought maybe it's from Matlabatini as well. Oh, wow. No, it's from Matlabatini. No, say be last week. I'm gonna tell you when we say more. I know. So Matlabatini, me. Yeah, um, yeah. So um. Okay, you want to get into Let's it? Let's get into it, man. All right. P. Diddy has been arrested. <laughs> <laughs> um, Diddy. And he was found with over a thousand <coughs> bottles of baby oil. <laughs> and um, his uh, indictment has been public. It's been unsealed now. So is it really, is it really, really, really a thousand? Or is it just like a rounded off number? No, it's a thousand. There are pictures. But it's crazy. They are basically... Hey, they're throwing everything at him from sex trafficking, human trafficking, racketeering. The list goes on and on. You might just get hit with the Rico. Who was counting? On. My body. The feds. Yo, everybody police are sometimes. I'm not seeing them. But I know I'm a petty boy. They were going to first day and they're going to be a lot. And they keep interrupting him so he starts all over again. Fuck, I got a cut again. I was in 750. Damn it. What? <laughs> you know, you don't want to start all over again. You gotta be careful, Bro. dog, because you could touch the bottle that's open. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Guys, like what? <laughs> what, what? What are you doing with a thousand bottles of baby? You wine? must tell Yo. us. I'm getting you his friend. Hey, when you have the party, <laughs> you are his friend. Tell us. I was at what was happening? One party. One party. Okay, what okay, happened? Then I arrived at six o'clock in the morning. Okay. From other parties. Okay. Me, I went stage two. The DJ set up next to the DJ. From there, went to the food trucks, food trucks, went home. So there's uh, nobody no who looked like they were shining. No, no one, <laughs> no one hollered at you. No. no one was like, you, what beautiful Can chocolate, I, the, man. The only thing, the only thing. <laughs> like, was well, nobody's hug slipper ring? Yes. No, hold on, hold on. Also, don't you invite to the main house? No. No, the main house was closed. Now we put the PT you had your own stage my punk young man. Ah, you guys don't see me. <laughs> no, 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 man. So e, 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 the only thing now that I remember if I think back, the only thing but it was his house. Mm. You know, he pulled that up that he lives in. Yeah, yeah. Mm. He pulled up in a robe. But it was also at like Six seven o'clock in the morning. So this was after he has done doing the so deed. So how that? Okay. Yeah. Now, now, now but now that you think about allegedly. it, mm -hmm. so allegedly. Next me now. Me now. Can I ask the question? Fuck yes. that. Yes, but can I ask yeah. this? And like during the time of like the Epstein thing, this sure. is what I thought. Yeah, well, sometimes, unga figa go ake. Like you get to Teddy's house, and sure. everything that you saw about sure. Paris Hilton are blooming. The DJ box yeah. is there. The food trucks are there. Sure. People are having a good time. Sure. All of that's going on in like let's call it the main stage of the party. <laughs> Because you don't have access, you yeah. don't yeah. Like in some of the testimonies I was hearing, Uguti, there's the main house and then there's another house there's at Paula. the back sure. house. No, <laughs> don't, don't do that. That's my plan. <laughs> nah, I, I, I went too hard. I went too hard. My hands, 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 <laughs> this <Ooh, the> delicious <laughs> mess. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yes. Okay, so in the testimony of this person, sure. Bebati, no, these people, they kept going, wherever they were referring to, kept going from the main house, buy on Gena, we pack house, yeah, bo? Sure. And we weren't allowed there, type sure. of thing. Sure, you know, yeah. like, this is like girls who've been to the house before, type. Because sure. now everybody has something to say. Sure. But when I thought about it practically, and like I'm saying, it's Katska Epstein. I thought the same thing, is that we can all go to the party and sure. have the fucking time of our lives because sure. everything's completely normal where yes. we can see. Where we are, yeah. But you can't. It's like when he came out in the robe, who the fuck knows what he was doing before sure. he came out sure. in the robe? Sure. You know, now that stuff is coming out and it's, let's be honest, most of it is really fucking weird. Yeah. And I think sure. that's where people have the major issue. Yeah, but what is into like the criminal charges? That's the stuff they're going to have to go in and start proving. But sure. I think in the court of public opinion, now that we know, you know, it's, it's coming across as fucking weird. Yeah. Every interview that I watch now sure. of whether it's Diddy, Meek Mill, Usher, or Justin Bieber, yeah, because 
Bagzile mfani. Ah, tambak mfani. Ah, ya bona. Many South Africans who must explain. Yeah, there's a lot of people that need to explain. No, I'll tell you, we rocked up. Razmatas. It was the weekend of Ultra Music Festival. We rocked up the so we did like we did Ultra Music Festival then we went to go play at other um, like after parties and then uh, around yeah about four or five when we were done with all those after parties then we're like okay gents it's time to go uh, thingy mm -hmm. we're going to uh, Diddy's party so his parties literally start around then um, coffee was playing uh, so mm. oh yeah we all arrived That's there we pray for coffee like, as well it's, cra it's crazy full people trying to get in and then what people Invited kids, bro. Or? Football player. I mean, well, uh, American football players, models, like the who's who of the zoo that yeah. are in Miami. Like everyone's trying to get in. Even I forgot the I forgot the basketball player. I remember when we were walking in, the security was like, "Yo, dog, I know you, but right now you can't come in." Mm -hmm. You know, and then they were like, "Yo," oh, then it's like, "Oh, these guys must come in." They let us in, and it's like, "Yo, I know all of these people from television." You know, from seeing them on TV, but, you know, they were struggling to get in. Anyways, later they do get in. You know? So it's like, it's not, a, it's not an easy ticket to get inside one of those parties. Mm. Once you get there, it's free alcohol, free food. Mm -hmm. But do you think they make it hard on purpose so that, like, when you get in, you make give? Make it hard. Wow. <laughs> 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 no, it's like, <laughs> no, obviously, <laughs> obviously, obviously, I think, like, any other party, like a big ticket party like that, or big, you know, mm. you want to, or the who's who. Exclusivity. You know, yeah, exclusivity mm -hmm. is the main thing. So obviously there's going to be chances, there's going to be people who are bringing their plus 11s or whatever it yeah. is. Also, so let's not forget at the time, like speaking to that picture, <laughs> like... Um, <laughs> 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 Wrong. 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 Zabad. Oh, when you put Coco in an empty club and she comes into the entourage, owner oh, gets happy. Owner gets happy and then oh, I'm the rider. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Wait, Wait, what did you say? Sorry, I don't know, fun. So, the picture is the picture of Rez Mates, <laughs> your experience, black coffee, and many others. At the time that you went there sure. after Ultra Miami, guys, sure. let's not forget Diddy was the guy yeah. of party. Yeah. 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 It was the ticket to have, it was the party to be at. Sure. Now, obviously, when we're looking at it, sure. we're saying, you know what sure. I mean? Like, what was yeah. happening? And it's a fuck up because one of the, I think one of the people that's getting it the worst was some of the, is like Meek Mill. Meek sure. Mill. Actually, now there's like a leak of an audio no, recording. That was debunked a long time ago. But was... my point is, yeah. he hasn't... Go look at any tweet he puts out. Sure. Although it was debunked, and no. even if it wasn't, there's no proof that that's Meek Mill, dude. That's just random yeah, voices yeah, yeah, on the recording. Yeah, yeah, my yeah. point is, you now have... He's suffering on social media sure. for a rumor. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Whereas when he was moving with Diddy and they were taking all those photos together and they were operating together, we were all like, away. Yeah, 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 Meek yeah, Mill, yeah Let's yeah. do it. Yeah. Now... Everyone is catching strays. Jay Z, Beyonce, Michelle, and Barack Obama are catching strays. Oprah is catching strays. Oh, Anybody that was photographed with this guy at any time sure. now, all of a sudden, yeah. you are evil. And it's like, guys, I was in the main house. I was by the food truck. Ben had him move. I'm trying to go delicious. Well, I need to get you. I'm sitting here. I need to buy a car. Give me delicious. You are not. Who is food truck? Can move. No. So, so yeah, man. I just. Obviously, I was also shocked when I was like, oh, a thousand bottles. And I was, I think uh, it was at the Miami house. Yeah, bro. Was, yeah, it's the same crib. Mm. Uh, I think it's called, uh, it's, it's on Star Island, if I'm not mistaken. How do you even place that order for baby oil? Bro. Like, where do you buy it from? Who, the, I mean, uh, when you pity, you know the people. It's but anyway, so, so yeah, I, I, I just think there's two things that I wanted to talk about this when I saw all of it happening. It was like, surely... You know, because there was a one security who's now got a big mouth. Yes. So yes, I yes. was saying that, that surely, body got dude. yeah, mm. I was like, surely you are part of the nonsense, like you are yeah. part of, you of there, the crimes bro. that are committed. Because mm. you, you, the first person to look away is usually your your bodyguards, or mm. well, the first person to be involved in terms of organizing some of the yes. stuff is your security. Picking also for up, his own dropping pleasure yes. as well. Yeah. Huh? You know, also for his own pleasure as yeah, well. Yeah. Yeah. There's, there's things that he's done as well. Like, you oh, know? this is what we do in this company. Let's rock. Let's rock. Yeah. You know? So for me, it was that. And then the second thing was like, I just think Diddy's getting a backlash of 
like he pissed off the wrong people. Yeah. Like I've seen a few. I've seen. I've oh yeah, my bad. I've seen a few people saying that like he's pissed off the wrong execs or the wrong people. Yeah, I saw you that. Yeah. Even I think even Fifty Cent was saying that with the whole alcohol chat. I think once he left the and then he started the whole Dillion thing. Like obviously, there's a lot of conspiracies or mm. you know speculations. Speculations. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, uh, speculations. But yeah, I mean, I just think. Him having videos of a lot of people who obviously will piss off a lot of people. And I just think he's pissed off the wrong Crowd. people at the top. He, and now... In regards to pissing those people off, yeah. this is my thing. They're going right? to pull an on him. He seems to be taking... He's taking the heat on behalf of... It's like during the, the Harvey Weinstein sure. era as well. Yeah. Sure. They were saying, you know, Harvey Weinstein is... Yes, he did do all of those things. Sure. So it's not to excuse him and say, no, yeah. he did all of those things, but he did it as part of a culture that exists 100%. where it's kind of like the done thing and everybody's doing it. Yeah. J, we don't know their names. And sure. in the same way, P. Diddy wasn't alone at those parties. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. And he 100%. wasn't organizing for himself. Sure. But because he's the famous guy. Sure. He's the promoter. Sure. Okay? Yeah, yeah, of yeah. the event. Oh. He is the face of this culture that exists. Sure. And unless we get the other names of the people, Mm. That were Which also. Which I'm sure will be the case. Oh. It might be. You know, my thing is, PH, I don't think so, dog. Like you say, sure. for me, I'm getting that sort of like he pissed people off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's still wrong. In Diane Zile, like if the criminal charges are special. Sure. Let's not leave the Cassie stuff like. No, you know, definitely. I mean, yeah. you can't do that, you know? Yeah. But a lot of the stuff, it's like, you know, people, a lot of the stuff is also like just weird sexual stuff sure. that you might find weird, but it's not a crime. Sure. You sure. understand? Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, sure. if yeah. he's having sex with multiple genders and whatever, like, he must do his thing. Sure. You understand? If the man's gay, he must be gay. Sure. If he's straight and he likes weird shit, if he likes to watch, whatever, cool. As sure. long as everybody is consenting there and, and this is just and a sex legal. body. Yes. Yeah. But the illegal stuff, beating the shit out of chicks, doing stuff, drugging people and raping them, that yeah, shit is not, not on you. Yeah. But if Diddy was doing it, I refuse to believe that it wasn't like a thing that is pervasive in the whole culture of yeah. Hollywood, sure. LA, sure. the music industry. And I think that's the part that we'll probably never get to, but it is sure. the part we need to get to. People need to realize that, yo, these people do fucked up shit, dog. Sure. I think you get to a level of wealth or a level of money where... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You get the and the normal fun. stuff is normal. Yeah, they, yeah. Just, they get so, so weird. A thousand bottles of oil. To og. That man, like, going to find a pause at least. Time, Father. Wrong father. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, um, Titi is some more now. Yeah, some more. Because he's on suicide watch. No, so that's, oh, what, so that's, that's, that's what I was saying. <laughs> is that, like, this is, like, 5 to... Um, five Epstein. to Epstein. Yeah, 5 mm. to yeah. Epstein. He's even in the same... He's literally in the same prison. He's in New York. And really? That's where Epstein was also being held. Oh, shit. Ah, and it's he disappeared, yeah. Ah, it's child. Well, he, he offed himself. Maybe... I don't think Epstein offed himself. No, definitely not. No, I he's on an island somewhere. Himself. Allegedly Still offed continuing. himself. Still <laughs> continuing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> most probably. Still Epstein Still Island. But, but with, with, with... You know, when Diddy applied for bail, for example, he was that like, he'll kill, give 50 mil yeah, I was like, and shit. a house. Yeah. Right? And then he was like, he promises not to have any female over to his house sure. like no female visitors sure. you know and people were like oh my man what do you mean female uh -huh. sure, hey, it's, it's a wide variety right. you oh. understand sure. so I think that was going to be his cap to say yo yeah I need to escape because it's almost like if you know what's coming you know you've pissed off the wrong example yeah. sure. more importantly you know the shit that you've done and it's on tape the sure. shit that's been recorded they raided your house dog they took the mm. stuff Usasela. <laughs> You know, did he did he feel that he's untouchable? Did he feel like he's gonna have the protection he's used to having? Like no one is gonna come for him? Because now, yo, bro, even when his kids pulled up outside court and then they're walking up the stairs, I mean, I'm fine. It's tricky. Okay, well, bringing it home to this past weekend where South Africa got to experience some snow. The N3 was backed up for like a couple of hours, well, days, Yeah. with a whole lot of snow. What are you guys' take on that? It's snow, okay? Why are you going to get it? It's not, it's not, it's not, like, it's not, it's different, yeah. Yeah, it's not, 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 so, I think, I was like, oh, this is cool, but, obviously, 
as the snow got heavier and heavier, mm. it didn't become cool because South Africa is not equipped. Yeah, to we're not deal ready. With snow. Yeah, we're not ready. Mm. And I think what I hated the most about this weekend was all the people who were saying, "Yeah, but why did they travel?" Even though there was warning, and I'm stupid? like, "But guys, wait, was, yeah, okay. was there warning of extreme snow? Yes, there, there was. was. Yeah, oh, in the God. days leading up, eh? Yes, they really? were like, "Yo, if you because it's a long weekend, so they were expecting sure. people to travel." So but what was the warning? The warning was that through Van Rienen's pass, yeah. they're expecting heavy rainfall, possible snow. You understand? Like, it the the, the pass becomes impossible when yeah. you those type of conditions exist. The roads become slippery. Yeah. Sure. yeah. So it's just the conditions Con that you don't want to travel in will be present. So sure. if you're thinking of going ungai, especially this, from Friday to whenever the snowfall is, this, is happening. Uh, Montrose. Which side is it? Montrose. Yeah. Is it Montrose? Okay. So Montrose, yeah. Harry Smith. Yes. That's Van Rienen's yes. spot. Oh, yeah. Okay. So that whole yeah, that road, stretch yeah, of road, is, yeah. Can be tricky when it rains. And it's yeah. also like, it's 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 a lot of kilometers, man. Sure. You're talking yeah. like, you know, 40, 60 k's sure. of snow. Sure. I'm going to go to the nearest garage or whatever. Sure. Like some people were stuck really, really, really remote stuck. in terms yes. of it wasn't walking distance. Yes. Yeah. And to clear the snow on the road, I mean, farmers were helping and stuff. A lot of farmers came with their tractors. Yes, they were showing yes, people yes. with graders and stuff like that. Oh. How do you clear 60 kilometers of, of snow? Road. Yeah. You know, there's yeah. cars in between. You've got to now work around the cars, mm. you know? So I just feel like uh, we're not equipped to deal with snow because who 100%. the hell? Yeah. 100%. Where I grew up uh, in KZN, it snows more often than like up here, honestly, okay. in my experience. Like sure. when I was younger, at least once a year at school, it would snow and we'd basically get a snow day at school. We'd all be allowed to go on the school field and snowballs and whatever. Sure. But it was never deeper than this. Yeah. In fact, and that's what I wanted after, to ask. Yeah, yeah, once yeah. it's been run over a little bit, it's it tired, becomes yeah. mud. Oh, yeah, you know? okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas this snow that I saw there in Van Rienen's Pass was like up yeah. almost yeah. a meter. Like, Dude, a meter mm. deep. Movie, How do you movie even... type of snow. Bruh. Yeah. You get out and you walk in that. You're going to die. Yeah. Also, people were, they were stuck for such a long period of time. There was one lady I saw on Twitter, like, I don't know, she was a diabetic and she was, she'd been without food now for like 24 hours or whatever. Crazy. So the auntie was not in a good way. Another one with the baby, I don't know, the baby needed like emergency, what, what, because sure. again, you stuck in a car, dog. Sure. Yeah, apparently Penny Dooley as well was yeah. hospitalized. Yeah, yeah. Hospitalized? Yeah. yeah. Well, well, uh, what? Hypothermia. So hypothermia, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was yeah. she sitting outside the car? Uh -uh. No, <laughs> no, man. Wow, <laughs> this concept of outside, eh? <laughs> this concept of outside. No, is <laughs> no. She well, she did go out. That she walked. Didn't she try walk to go get food or something? Or the br the brother went her. walk to go get food, if I'm not mistaken. And then she went to rescue. And then, uh, yeah, something along those lines. But obviously, <laughs> yeah, it was bad. But she's in hospital. Shout out Penny oh, Dooley. Yeah. Get well soon. I love oh. Penny. She's the one from Kagasi with the uh, salary. Yeah. 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 Hopefully she'll be fine. Hopefully she will be fine. Yeah, then so it will yeah, make laughing at her less uh, offensive. Oh, wow. <laughs> so for me, I think yeah, GNU, GNU in, the, in the next discussion must uh, talk about such things. No. But uh, equipping equipping the country with snow. To, oh, am I uh, highly skilled? I'm all highly skilled. Yes. <laughs> Since they fucking trying to bring, what are they trying to do? They're trying to fucking bring. Uh, <laughs> Hello, woman in tech. Yeah, woman. In, that's what she does. That's what woman in tech does. I feel you now. Now uh, I'm doing. No, they're trying to bring in what? What are they trying to bring in? Eleven thousand. Eleven thousand highly skilled employees to work go home affairs. So fuck South Africans. Where to to work where? Home affairs. To work in home affairs. So yes. fuck South Africans. Oh, highly skilled. That, that, that is the department that they'll be working have, in. So have they, have they broken? South Africans. No. Basically. <laughs> oh, okay. Wait, why are they high? What makes them highly skilled versus? I guess, Ananasi, we want to so know. So of the gra many graduates, uh, you know, capable of, 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 of doing the, spa the basic work that they, they are looking for, they are saying, no, let's, let's fly in. Experts. 11,000 people from overseas. Oh, what did they call them? Accommodate them mm. and, 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 and use what? South African tax, tax Place them. money. Place them yeah. in the yeah. Boost the economy by 1.8%. Boost the massive. Wait, why are they? Because this is my thing with their skill level, right? And I'll tell you guys, 
I, I had an experience, not me personally, it's someone I was helping with um, Cape Town, right? Home sure. Affairs, I think it's in Belleville or whatever. Sure. Is it Belleville? Belleville no, yeah, I don't know Belleville, Cape Town. Belleville, yeah. In any case, the Home Affairs is in Belleville. And a lot of the people that come to the Home Affairs, as you know, Cape Town, they all speak Afrikaans because sure. the employees come from Mitchell's Plain or sure. whatever. Sure. So the people that are working by the counters are rapping in Afrikaans and or Kosa. Sure. But the people that are needing service are coming with Mogadishu. Sure. There's oh. other Somalians and Ethiopians. Now you've got an issue where this Language person barrier. Yeah, sure. is trying to explain to you or articulate, yo, I'm here, I'm on asylum papers or I'm on a 100%. visa. Oh. And the person behind the counter is like, you understand? Yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. even an English oh. Mogadishu, it's an English Mogadishu, Afrikaans, Afrikaans <laughs> barrier sure. of language. Sure. Could it be that Home Affairs is trying to bring in people? Because at this point now we have to start ah, accommodating. Don't think, 11, 000, I don't think Cape 11, Town... Because this is, what, is this is this is this Western Cape or South Africa? No, so, no, I'm I'm South using Western Africa. Cape as an example. Oh, 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 okay, cool. Someone that I was assisting was like, "Yo, I went to this home affairs, dog. I don't know what's going on there. The people behind the counters are speaking Afrikaans, and of course, I'm not understanding. Everybody that's there is they're screaming at each other. These sure. ones are all also not from here. So I kind of I left, you know. And I was like, I thought about well, it, and I was like, look, it's an you interesting service take, who, but I don't think eleven. Like again, we've got. People, is it linguistics? People yeah. study linguistics. But more than enough people in this country, surely, who can... So you're saying we don't need to From a language. No, right. just from that one point that you raised of language, you know. But again, I find it very difficult to say that there aren't 11,000 people who are can be put through a program, mm. if needs be. That can to fix skill this. them up. Yeah, to mm. skill yeah. them up and place them... In no. these jobs. No, 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 you know, if you're flying with these people, accommodating them just to go work at home affairs. Wow, I just want to nah, know, what boss. are they doing, man? Nah, I, like, for me, it's always, the devil is in the details. Sure. It yeah. sounds like a cock plan. I'm sure. agreeing with you guys. But we need to know what they're doing. What for they're me, planning. the only challenge I see that you might need help from outside with home affairs mm. is the language thing, yeah. to my knowledge. Sure, but sure. I mean, I don't work but in also that, that can That can also, like, be... You know, mm. so you can also, like, our people are unemployed, man. They must... They need work. We need work. There was, mm. I had a, I tweeted someone today. There's, like, this other spy, man. I don't know, he's from Turkey or whatever. Turkey he's always spy. tweeting bullshit. Yeah. You know that guy. He was like, no, uh, checkers must fire all the 60-60 riders. Mm. They have a week to comply or else they're going to fucking raid checkers and shit. Oh. And I was like, because remember we had Zimasa on the show? Yes. And I was like, nah, dog, that's actually a scarce skill. Technically, mm -hmm. the riding motorbikes thing, because when Uzim was here, Mustaf, I you know, because the people that ride the bikes come from countries where it's normal. Bikes are really, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like scooter, yeah. the yeah. riding of bikes is a normal thing. It's sure. a normal mode of transport. Sure. They arrive here with 10, 15 years experience riding a bike. Sure. If you have to jump on a scooter Xasa, to get food delivered in under 60 minutes, you're going to fall. Yeah, yeah you I'm going to yeah, well, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I think, yeah, see, that's a fair, yeah, that's a fair, fair point, you know, valid point, and that's, yeah. it's a sector that I'm prepared to say, okay, cool, but it needs to be obviously regulated properly, sure. you also can't just have, you know, All when you them. go to some takeaway spots, bro, in Joburg, you can't even park, because yeah, everywhere, sure. Yeah, sure. Sure. and also, they're arguing over, because, you know, the trips come in and stuff, sure. yeah. this real thing that I saw, where now, they arguing and they're like, no, PH must take this. Tr you know, like it's like, it's intimidating. Mm, nah, mm, I can't mm. pull up a Debonese and buy a pizza because I'm like, yeah, but buy a First problem is eating mm. pizza from Debonese. Yeah, they no, mm. you are wrong. <laughs> no, no, you are wrong. That's your first problem. Who's that shy pizza? I'm the only one who's in the bag. I'm the only one in the bag. Out of all, all pizza spots, see, Teponeza. I'm sure, dog, if the Italians were to discover a fucking Teponeza, they would be like, what the fuck is this? I'm done the pizza in the Vienna part. Nah, so I just, think, I just think it's weird, man. But uh, let's, yeah, hopefully we can see next week when they take a deeper dive. No, no? No, I think it should just be... 
something that they just even in the planning phase they need to lock that thing away mm. we don't need 11000 people coming in um well, we don't know. the people that you have at but the moment sure. bring in if you want to bring in new blood Sure. Skill them, put them in a program, as you said. Yes. Uh, give South Africans a chance. That's mm. my issue. Yeah, 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 yeah. The first solution is yeah. not mm. us. Yeah. It's yeah. already looking True. outside. Mm. And I do think that we have the skill set, not necessarily for home affairs, but sure. you do have people that are great thinkers, sure. they great innovators. We have lawyers that are unemployed. Bring those people Tons in. Of people, yeah. Home yeah. affairs needs all of those things yeah, that you bring mentioned. Bring those people yeah. in. Yeah. They're highly skilled. Sure. So. Hey, but uh, 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 one thing I will say is Home Affairs has been working overtime of late, at least to our, I see on television, a rating, a rating stores left, right, and center. Yeah. I find it, it's, like a, it's like a catch-22. It's like they're rating stores, right? So I think got Tang got shut down last week. Yes, but then uh, Tang came out and said, listen, you know, we pay our waiters. Remember there was the whole, because it, it just it coincided with the Babel Babel did, thing. Yeah. So the heat was for the immigration sure. people raiding to see sure. who's legal. Sure. But then they also just caught smoke to say, you're not paying people, you're only paying tips. And Tang came out and said, sure. yo, our people make on average 20K plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and, our and, niggas are nice. And yeah. bro, the, the, the model of tips was, uh, I guess, it, on, on certain establishments and certain, call it, settings, you will make a lot of money mm. from tips, like especially if at a place like Tan. Like yeah. 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 Where the cost per unit on the items is high. Is high yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But and and the you know the clientele that go there are the ones that are willing to, to tip well. To tip as well yeah. you know? uh, I mean, some of the establishments that we go to in terms of the nightlife. Again, well, not Debonairs. <laughs> apart from <laughs> apart from Debonairs, <laughs> apart from Debonairs, where I mean, yeah. some of the waiters that I know are, are driving Mercedes. Cars, they've yeah. got iPhone 14s. Whoa, Mercedes. Hey. Yeah, but it's a cheap machine as car. Yeah, oh, Pro, yeah. But, uh, like yes. Uh, like, Lamantu uh, Sabo, all uh, You must go to some of the clubs. Like, There's one I know, because, you know, mm. they were the other shop with yeah. the G class. One man G63, Uputi. He's been a head waiter He's for, a waiter, for yeah. over 20 years. I'm in the wrong profession. No, no, yeah. No. Well, think about it this way. It's like if we go out for a meal at Tang, I'll use sure. Tang as an example. We are going to each have something to eat. We'll have drinks. And if we're there for two to three hours, sure. the bill is nothing under three, four K. Uh, not even more. more. Much more. Right. Yeah. So more, let's say more, five. More. Yeah. We're, like, we're not drinking sure. like it's your birthday. <laughs> we're just having <laughs> drinks, right? Sure. Let's say the bill is five K. You as the waiter are getting 500, 500. from us. Yeah. We've occupied you for 90 minutes to two hours. That's one of if your you tables. you repeat that, yeah, that's, what, and that's, that's one, one of, of your tables. tables. Yeah. You could have a table with 10 people. Sure. Now your tip is two grand. Sure. It adds up, you know? Sure. And these guys, you're talking about guys, a, a waiter serving a table that's buying bottles sure. yeah. for 200,000 rand. Sure. You see? So and from it's, the jump, it's one it's, of his favorite, like it's a yeah. client that knows him, is always dealing with him. Yeah. Sure. That guy's leaving that brow with 50k. They call, sure. him, they call him from the get-go, yo, we're coming through. Sure. He said, organize. And we, we want to yeah. pour. Because I mean, even a simple, like just simple clientele mm. of me and my lady in a club. Mm. Maybe if it's my cognac and her champagne. Sure. I mean, we already look at Hubli because Hubli. Hey, I'm telling you Hubli, but no, it's not Hubli. Hubli is a vibe. No, it's just the mixing in the kitchen. Like they just yeah. they where, where is the scam? Is the scam in the colds that are burning no, out the too scam. quickly? Because that fucks up a hubli. Is the scam in the the flavor, the maybe flavor. a short. Yeah. No, it's in the quality of the flavor, I, the amount of flavor they put in. I think the scam. I don't want to call it a scam because I mean I'm in the business yeah, of supply. No, like, tell us. Because no, I just think it's a new shock to realize that things are like hubli that you have, that you have is being costed where you are at three hundred percent. If that is no, the price model, three hundred percent. No, I'm just saying some oh, places. Okay. Some yeah. places take it to the extreme. Yeah. yeah, you know. But I'm just saying is that obviously to you at home. Your, 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 the actual hubby itself, you most probably bought it once for how much? What, 500 bucks? Yeah, okay. Coal costs you, what, 40, 40 rand, 50 rand? I mean, not coal? 50 rand for a box, that coconut coal. Coal, coal yeah. flavor. So obviously, the, to, to, to set up, to re set up a hubby is very cheap. Mm. So yeah. to set up one hubby with one head at home. smokes 20 bucks. Yeah, yes. basically. Mm. At home. Yeah. Not even. Mm. But in an establishment where 
obviously they won. You, you're buying it like you are buying any other thing, alcohol, sure. food. It's going to be priced at a higher price for convenience sake, yeah. firstly. So they mark their shit up yeah, 2,000. Of course, it's gonna <laughs> but obviously now I understand your <laughs> cry. I understand your cry to say, I'm fine. You have a thousand rand. Come on, let's go. the line. Ah, I'm fine. You know, the thing is, I also understand, like, from from your point of view, sure. as an event organizer and someone who's dealing with these things, in the back of your mind, there's always that thing of, but these people will smoke regardless. Regardless. Shims had tried this out, because remember Shims had hang out first, was like, hey, Dabaya yeah. Hablin. Dabaya <laughs> Blita. Ah, I'm fine. Like, he first started saying, you know what, like, like Hablin, you're burning my couches, you're burning oh, my furniture, yeah, yeah, what, what, yeah. what, what. Then he came back in the following week or something like that with a crazy price, like a ridiculous, ridiculous price. And people still smoke, smoke mm. Hubley. So it's like, hey, these people are going to smoke no matter what. And I think that's what Hubley dealers now have <laughs> realized. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dealers. Yeah, <laughs> dealer dealers. I think that's what they've realized, that we will smoke Regardless. Cool. What yeah. is it about Habli? Because I don't uh, understand this culture. Flavored air. Busy Ask him. He's smoking a vape smoking right on the show. Now. Look, and yeah. eating a sucker. Yeah. Not yeah. gay. Yo, fine. <laughs> not gay. Yo, <laughs> Yo fine. Gay. <laughs> Finally, let's talk to this penny. Yeah. Yeah. Good evening. 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 No, oh, so for me... Where did you get these ones? Remember, women in tech... So oh, nice. Mm. Yeah, the hustler, the protection <laughs> fee? <laughs> <laughs> you see, you're on the protection <laughs> <laughs> So, I think, look, Hubley's nice. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think I used to smoke it back in the day. Not anymore now. Um, you had to always smoke it. Like, if you wanted to pull bitches, like yeah, yeah, Hubley yeah. was the one. Yeah, yeah, Hubley is the thing. Oh, but, okay, right. actually, you know what, guys? Now, I just thought about it now. Shisha is fucking expensive overseas. Like, okay. we actually have it good. Now, I, I, real, I just realized, I've never had, I've never raised this point. Shisha, you almost probably pay the equivalent of like one five, two thousand rand Four. at a shisha place. One head. Yeah. But that's but, the proper shisha. Yeah, nice. that's proper shisha. Yeah, Obviously, yeah that's I remember, like, we now, we are paying the prices that we're paying in South Africa for flavor and stuff yeah. from Plaza. Sure. You know, this is yeah, Mogadishu yeah. import. This is yeah. not, it's not the same. Yeah, not but I'm just thing. saying, it's just like, the whole the whole concept behind Shisha was, it's it's relaxing. Um, it used to be for the rich back in the day. I think in, in the, I don't know, the Middle East or these Middle Eastern countries. The Sultan. And yeah, the white then obviously, you know, as things developed throughout the years, it became a luxury smoke. It's, it's, is, is it less harmful than cigarettes? Uh, it feels that way. But, but yeah, it's probably, probably the yeah. same thing. But probably like, the same thing. With man. cigarettes, because you can feel cigarettes killing you sure. while you're smoking. But probably you're enjoying your death. The slow it's, killer. It's, it's, it's yeah. a recreational, like cigarettes, somebody who smokes, smokes because sure. they are addicted to nicotine. Sure. Yeah. With Hubley, you're not, there's no nicotine. It's uh, the flavor. It's the flavor. Some of the flavors do have nicotine. Some, okay. Yeah. But yeah. you're not smoking it like, yo, I need to have Hubley now. Yeah. You know, you're not yeah. lighting up a Hubley every five or 20 unless, minutes. Unless you're, you're Milano, my child. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Milano, is no, Milano, Colors, Colors people Milano move will like never let like PhD teach you without him having a hobby. <laughs> Colored Colors people move with like portable hobbies, you know? Oh, Milano, Milano's my, so Milano's my security. Yo, look, if you want to make that man like smile, I'll just give him a hobby. Anything else? Like, if you want to upset well. him, yeah, take him to a place where there's no, no hobby. Yeah. Like, Milano can chill the whole night, he doesn't have to drink. He doesn't have yeah. to. Well, nothing. he doesn't drink he on can, the job. No, so, I'm just yeah. saying, like, he can stand in one place sure. as long as he's got a hubby. If he doesn't have a hubby, one yeah. hour in, he's like, when are we leaving? <laughs> yes. I want to go, man. <laughs> Smoke a pipe. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out, Lano. <laughs> <laughs> I need a pipe, dog. Yeah, but, but, but e e e yeah, I think, uh, like, the price of, just to wrap it up, I think the price of e e e e Lendo, Hubley's is very jarring in some establishments. Yeah. So it's just like, you are really paying for one round for a thousand bucks, and oh, it's a thousand bucks initially, and then what? Refill the money. Depends on how they're feeling. I know there's a, there's a place in Pretoria that charged me six six sixty for the hubli and six sixty for the refill. Yes, that's like, well, another hubli. That's another hubli. And, and then there's what? Re, then there's like this new thing where guys are charging what three thousand rand or two thousand rand for a bottomless. Yeah, and then the bottomless, and then they charge you that price, and then they run away. You won't see them the rest of the night. Oh, God. oh the bottomless, depending yeah. on the service. Yeah. 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 But my yapel, and then you like, hey, put down the leg, yeah. it takes an hour. Now we must resort to using corruption ways of now. You pay two thousand rand for the hubli, then you must promise to tip him big, 
so that he can just so that he can serve as you coming know. back to you. We do that by the place where we go for the meat. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Like, hey, who's paying? Who's paying? There's clearly something in that happily. Um, but there's a pastor who's making the rounds before we wrap oh, up. Of course, the pastors show. and rounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Can say that yeah. again. <laughs> Carry on. I want you guys to watch. There's two clips I have for you guys. Just listen to what he's saying because clearly, if you are Christian and uh, you've participated in one. Or both of these things, mm. you are going to hell. Umboro. Which is which? I got funny situation. Love to see my corn. Love to see my corn. Once we are full of unyang, anywhere in the world, love to see my corn. We are full of unyang, but man, it's a time for training. It is more than unyang. It is more than unyang. It is more. He is about to build a building. So we are about to build a church in Zimbabwe. It is because when you know spirit, I'm not wrestling, and I'm not wrestling. I'm not the I'm not the man. I'm not wrestling. So again, lagu chingwa kona, but koga it tight. Abu sis na bo put tight. It tight emi zimbaya. But koga master makau ena abafas babantu na matota babantu. So umwa ya ubu febe ukona la falu bati. Mo babat koga le sintes babambi na mat tight wa. So zona ke. So it imoni le po di building liba kona. Bapa, bapa la panca macam awak bantu bong, kalau pakai mesin sim, because umur kita sudah mesin, bapa nak bayar uchin, tapi bapa nama bicep nama six aku. Okay, and here's the second one, which I think you guys will find interesting. Okay, interesting, interesting. Now he came to most of those conclusions. Bang you phone aku ti, mau bapa ni voice ekalai, ngasih hokui, ama voice la aichu, o bapa umur new mama. Babi is a ikameli one, but it's so easy, so easy. But we're not testing this. But it's an easy la, la bako. What? So what are you? So if we're not testing the band, we're going to need na bong kikati ni imshatu ni gasho ni so easy song. A band to la bako te ba imshatu ni work. You must repent. Niyo kodi sa gungu lungu. Ugu ya imshatu ni when door the imshatu any door. Begu kula masere preach. Kupa ulama kama wabo. Wow. Abantu kati baye la baye ula. Ngoba bebata na matimu. Na matimu ni begata la. Bapuza. Wena uma uzu puzi tlas. Uma wei bamba utu ya puzi. Ufuka iti mwoni tali puzi tlala before we. Ungezo kati putu. It's a spiritual world. Otata it last. We let her la. Before it fake. Iti mwoni la puzi. Ni puza ni chu. No, 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 it's all about Pusa Little Timon. Yeah, Pusa Little Timon is all about. No, it's all about Pusa Little Timon. There's no way. He don't even say he be so. He don't see him. He Timon. He Timon. You know when you say the right, he don't be Timon. He don't Pusa Tal. No, that's stupid. Come on, that's silly. You know, you know. Going viral, guys. He's gone viral, but it's like. Okay, he's quite viral because we're laughing at him. We think he's stupid. Yeah. But the fact of the matter is, and this is the thing I feel with a lot of churches and pastors, mm. there's like a lack of regulation when it comes sure. to who's allowed to and who's See, not allowed what, to. What? Sure. What's the word? Mauliti. Preach. Hmm? To, to preach. preach. Yeah. Yeah. Be to the head of own, a church. Yeah, you know, to like, have your own church as well. Yes, to have your own church so mm. that we know it's not a cult sure. or not yeah. lunacy what like this guy. What goes into... That is there a body of is there a body of priests? I think they, the different denominations have their own bodies, sure. but those bodies can't necessarily stop. Ph wants to open sure. Paula's church. Paula church sure. outside yeah. Rema in the parking lot. Funny So like, there's nobody who can actually basically stop you. Yes, because uh, it's a thing of. Cultures, a religion is a free practice in mm. in, in the country. Because I like I've been in churches and I've been, because my mother's a pastor, so I grew sure, up in the okay, church and okay. I have enough experience to know, like, to see that like, sure. you know, and Big time, yeah, yeah. No, bro. Nah. I hope for hope for me is a big currency, and if you are able to, if you are able to gather people into a house, yeah, and tell them what that is that they need to hear. People will do what you people will do what you say they must do. Yeah, you know, they're, they're looking for something to believe they, in. Yeah. And people Everybody's are, looking for some sort of miracle. And I think sure. that is why now, like even Upsangoma is growing faster than Christianity, because Christianity works on faith, sure. something that you can't see. But Upsangoma, at least they tell you what you know, man, go slaughter three chickens or sure. yeah. you'll be the king. Yeah. <laughs> you'll be the king of 
of two kings. You'll be the king of Mobo When you do that, it feels like you're physically doing something. And like prayer, where prayer is just talking. But now they're telling you to do something and it feels like this is coming, this is coming together. Like they tell you, go, go, go slaughter, go slaughter chickens, the masters will be yours. Like they'll tell you they you know, like I know the father. So people are always looking for something. You know? Yeah, sure. something to believe in. Yeah, and when you find when you find a pastor that is far far fetched, it is easier for him to have growing numbers sure. because he's now deviating from what we know. We know the way to trust in God to this. Yeah. Sure. But now when you have now a pastor, he's saying fantastic stuff. Yeah, when he says, you know, come come come, leave eleven thousand. I'll pray for you. It feels like you are doing. Sure. Something. Bushiri used to charge those rates like Muma eleven for for him to pray for you. Dude, do you know what that guy used to charge? Yeah, boy, he used to do like these call it dinner type setups. And yeah. then you, you could pay for to sit like for a seat. Next to sure. him. Next to him, like at his table, maybe like half a par. You're crazy. I'm yeah, telling yeah, yeah. you. If we let him over, it's like fifty K. What? Like Dude. they'd sell his So if you want to be on his table, you pay Do you know how much money Likas and I would have? <laughs> if you put for your sweat, I'll <laughs> listen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Nah, for me, for, for me, religion's not the one. Uh, I don't know. Sorry, not religion's not the one. These these new pastors, like these. Uh, yeah. Extreme. Yeah. yeah. Look, and also, I, I'm going to say it because that guy, and he's speaking Zulu in that clip, but you mm. can hear that he's not a Zulu oak. Mm. He's obviously using Zulu as his preferred. True. Yeah, but. Speaking up a bit of Sigisdi, yeah, yeah, you know, um, <laughs> it, 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 it's bigger, it's big here, yeah. it's become a big thing with the Bushiris and the mm. but outside, like in Africa, there's a lot of pastors that speak weird stuff, sure. you know, that's 100%. like culty in nature, sure. and it's also just like, yo, someone needs to step in here, yeah, sure. because you know, you had the Ugandan one who was like heavily anti gay, mm. and because his church was so big, the stuff that he was saying. The internet was laughing at, you know, because that's why Mac G got fired at YFM, is when he played that clip of that Pastor Martin guy, that uh, eat a poo poo. Oh, dude, yeah. Right? When I, they eat yeah, the poo poo. That's the guy. <laughs> so that guy, like, the world was laughing at the clips, like, ah, we are clearly so yeah. you know, the accent and what he's saying. Sure. But back home, where he came from, it wasn't a joke because his congregation sure, was taking that shit literally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now, me as a community member there, or member of the congregation, and I can be like, hey, PH, like, what can I do? What can I say about him? I go to the post and I say, you know, PH, PH is, we are late. Yeah, Next yeah, thing, yeah. dude, people are like, a mob is I'll organizing, yeah. coming to your house, beating the shit out of you and taking your furniture. Are you serious? I'm telling you, like, it was leading to like mob attacks and stuff because it was driving hate. And I feel like this guy, we laughing because he's saying everyone that went to Somizi's wedding is a, is a demon. But the people are but believing people him. But people are believing him and oh. taking it literally. And I don't believe everybody at Somizi's wedding My was a demon. My mother fell into a trap of a fake prophet once, a false prophet. So those bra, like, you know these false prophets, they're good with their words and mm, sure. persuading and what, what. And this bra came and he was a part of our lives. And then he started slowly in back. He was like... Stealing. No, 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 no. Like, we must burn our clothes. Like, we yeah. literally burned our entire wardrobe. So he started with Levi's. So he said Levi's is made under the sea, uh, some rubbish. <laughs> what? And then it's like, it, like because Levi's is 501, when you say 5 devil plus numbers, 0 plus yeah. 1, it makes 6. 6, six is a triple 6. And I my brother I had gang like Levi jeans. Luckily, I didn't have because size-wise, you know? Yeah. But my brother, you know, my brother, yeah. You were safe. Yeah, I was safe. My brother had gang, and then they had to burn my brother's jeans. And then they burnt his all stars. For then, real, for yeah, real. Yeah, then this bra came and he said, white formal shoes are actually from the devil. That's why Pastor Chris only preaches in white formal shoes. And at that stage, white formal shoes were a thing. And I was a <laughs> church boy, so I had like three pairs that the, were burnt. The square toes, yeah. right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah I had yeah, three yeah. pairs that were burnt. They burnt my white suits. That's Because every week he's coming with the new revelations about clothes, saying no, clothes with some printings are evil. Uh, the devil, like, yeah. Yay! Yeah. Yay, yay, yay. And who was the uniform in Bayer's called a pen? That bra came and he changed everything, everything in our lives. And then, Some foods as well from the devil. Yo! Oh, lady, you're the beating. Oh, lady, 
Really, she's on this bandwagon until one of her friends were like, no, whoa. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It was a proper yeah. intervention. And by the time we realized we had lost so much. Yeah. And that, that was the guy that said, hey, that showed me that I, these people. Tricky. Mm. Are very, very tricky. Very, 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 very tricky. <laughs> I, anyways, anyways. Up, uh, talk to us about your show. Got so a big I show have a show. Watch out. Ngashi Sapela Mina laughs at the capital. Mm-hmm. It's happening at That's the been capital. going on for quite some time, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I think this is my fourth, fifth, fourth, fifth, fifth one. one. Eh? Fifth mm. one, yeah. So I'm having a, a birthday one. Shout out. PH. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Shy cake, you're fine. Yeah, so 21 sure. cakes. <laughs> 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 my lineup includes Mpo Pops, Tumi Stop Nonsense, Nonto R, uh, Kumba, and then Oof. whoever else Oof. wants Fire to come lineup, through. Son. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. And then my tickets are on abutilolo.com. Okay, yeah. Agna, web tickets. Uh, Deal with you direct. Uh, uh, come to me direct, yeah. face me. Direct. Yeah, yeah, this Dope. Friday, 27th of September. At the Capitol on the Park in Senton, 101 sure. Catherine Street. Uh, Was on, guys. That's, that's, that's Ilendo. How many people? Yeah, I wanted to find out how many people do you usually have at the show? About 300. Okay, dope. Yeah, I'm trying to push for 500 this time, so dope. I'm going to take in the Dope. Okay. Please. Go out and get the, the tickets, man. Uh, yeah, Lolo's. come love. It's going to be quite, quite a show. <laughs> Actually, I, I, I think the one time I was meant to come, I ended up, ended up buying, like, what? Uh, you bought 10. The 10 one tickets, time, yeah. yeah, so... No, I'm available this time around, but I'll still buy. The, I'll go and buy the, t- the oh, tickets. Yeah. yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, yeah. Hubli, is Zwagal. Please, fun. Please, Hubli. Wouldn't it have the colored people? <laughs> Please. I'll be at the stage outside. The after parties at the polar stage. The after parties at the polar stage. We're going to take a coming. Yeah. Yeah, sure. We Friday, are yeah, let's, uh, let's get uh, White Bull up to the capital yeah. to buy us tickets there. But yeah, man, thank you very much for, thank you for having, me. Uh, having uh, for coming through. Yeah. Tell me, where else, what other shows are you doing besides this one? I do, do, I do opera every week. So yes. I have a weekly comedy That's what I want to ask opera, about. Yes. Yeah. Every Wednesday. Every Wednesday, yes. Mm. Wednesday. Yes, yes, um, yes. Different guests, I'm assuming. Every week, different guests. Okay. Yeah, so how's, that, how's that coming along? Fire, fire, fire. I yeah. think yeah, it's turning nicely into a nice comedy club. Dope. So it has picked up its momentum. It's doing its own thing now. Dope. So it's, it's okay. very dope, yeah. Tell me, are there, career, I don't want to say careers in comedy, but like, is it a sustainable, in, in South Africa? 100%, 100%. Especially if you, if you corporate. Sure. If you corporate, and then if you're lucky enough to have your own audience, like, like colors, Sure. Colors have a nice thing because colors support each other, sure. Indians as well. Sure. Colors support each other? Yeah, yeah, especially comedy. <laughs> <Yeah. What? laughs> you know what? No, 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 in comedy they <laughs> do. You yeah, know, yeah, they do. So. Like Robbie, the Goliath. The Goliath. Yeah, yeah. Dude, if, you, if you go to their shows, you get more than a comedy club. Yeah. They come ah, out. Ah, okay. By, by Valang okay. shows, I'm successful. Oh, hey. Yeah. But I'm not corporate. Some of them is not even doing comedy anymore. Actually, like he's just, just doing content, kids, um, yeah, content, and, yeah. And corporate. Fuck, and his content is fire. It's yeah, yeah. Nice. it's so silly. Like it's ridiculously good. Yeah. It's fire. Ever since Trevor Austin, I got. On that note, I tell you, no, no, I talk to Trevor Noah, I got. I got Trevor Noah. Don't you, don't you, don't you, my jokes work? You leave comedy same time. Yo, ba, Trevor. Yeah, Trevor. Hey, yeah, hey, 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 Trevor. I got, I got, I got. Yeah, hey, don't say that. He's back in the country. He watches the podcast. Uba like a Linda. I'm done with the daily show. Cheers. I'm a baby oil. No, we love you, Trevor. We love you, Trevor. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much. Mfana? Uh, thank you, my doggy. My dog, thank be you be nice. very much. Uh, all the best for your show. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Eastern yeah. Cape thing. Yeah. What? Yes. No, don't worry about it. Of course, I think. Yeah. yeah. His name is uh, Abu Tilolo. <laughs> Thank you very much for pulling through. Thank you for having me, guys. Another episode of the Shady Podcast in the bag. I'm going to go sleep. I'm fucking Yeah, go tired. sleep. Go Jesus get a rehydrate. Christ. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah. Can yeah. you come connect his trip? Yeah. Otherwise, see out. Yeah, like, subscribe. Uh, those no, well done to you like, guys actually. Let me follow. give you guys your flowers. Like very well done. Like dope. What? Dope dope production. Oh the like, show. Yeah, yeah. Well done on the show, guys. Yes. Thank, you. Thank, Thank you. Well done, Thank you, Thank, Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah man, go hit us up. Like, subscribe, comment, share. I love my podcast is kinda pissed on my crate. Podcast way no love. Oh my word. Hi. Hi.
podcast wa must end up bena podcast wenu aha ama podcast wenu we call right ama mic wa khona yes bambela ama podcast wenu yo ama podcast wenu we call right ama podcast na khuluma nje ama podcast wenu like na structure fan na na structure fear apa na khuluma nje Mafana bangani mafuna ukuchela ukuthi bani artist eshapha abanye bathi ukuqabza ke corona ama podcast wenu take it easy take it all hey ama podcast wenu we call right ama podcast wenu ama podcast wenu nabo cherry abakhuluma nje naye hey ama podcast wenu angazi bathi hey yaqabza ke never go overseas major league in ama podcast wenu Well, I'm not in season.